The most unsettling thing for state leaders right now is how fast we are seeing these cases rise. They tell us that this is caused by the how fast this Delta variant or how fast the incubation period is for this Delta variant, which is calling these spike in numbers that we're seeing. The surge in Mississippi has been getting national attention. ABC News spoke with the director of pulmonary and critical care at a hospital on the coast. Doctor, state officials have said the hospital system in Mississippi is on the brink of failure. Do you agree first off? And then does your hospital system have the resources it needs, including enough workers? Um, you know, certainly we are in a more dire situation than we've been in before. Um, certainly more dire than it was last year, even at its worst. The state has seen that additional cases routinely turn into additional hospitalizations and death. State epidemiologist Dr. Paul Byer says we have hit record COVID case numbers. We have um, now surpassed the peak that we had over the winter months, uh, which we thought was, was, was pretty tough at that time. And uh, I think one of the staggering pieces is the rapidity of how quickly we have gone up. Dr. Byers explained this wave crashed over the state quicker than the winter month surge, with over 100 deaths in the past four days, which is continuing to put a strain on hospitals and medical institutions. It is exhausting. We, we spend a week in the ICU per um, intensivist, and by the end of that week, we are completely drained both emotionally and physically. Dr. Byers tells us a growing age group for outbreaks are six to 10 year olds, American Medical Association President Dr. Harmon says the current outbreaks are being called the pandemic of the unvaccinated across the United States. Nationwide, uh, over 90 percent of the uh, hospitalizations are due to unvaccinated folks. It's 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 impressive. The uh, vaccines are very effective against the Delta variant, and we know that 93 percent of the cases nationally are the Delta variant. Dr. Byers tells us that the state of Mississippi is in a real tough spot and that he doesn't see it getting better anytime soon. Live in Jackson, Grayson Gordon, 16 WAPT News.